I like solving complicated problems. I like, I'm a, I'm a systems oriented kind of person. I, I like taking a bunch of complicated individual systems and seeing how they work and put them together and, and building a process. At Arizona Facility Services, we focus on uh, data centers, financial institutions, and merchant corporation. So in a data center, a ton of data is being processed. In some instances, they're processing credit card data, in other instances, email, other instances, some other application altogether. Typically, we don't have a luxury of building a brand new data center from scratch. You know, that means we are retrofitting live data center that's supporting mission critical data. We have to be able to maintain service and in event of a failure, we still have to produce 100% uptime. Data centers that we work with, that are typically large data centers from 10 megawatts to 20, even larger than that, which generates three, four hundred thousand dollars utility bill a month. So our ability to reduce the energy consumption by two, three, four percent, the savings are huge. One of the nice things uh, we found at AFS with working with Opto has been that they use non-proprietary systems. A lot of our customers are used to seeing five different systems to manage five different pieces of equipment. Um, with Opto, we're able to integrate that into one system. With Opto, we're able to do BACnet, Modbus, we're able to do SNMP, we're able to do any of the IP protocols. All this backup infrastructure that maintains the data center, we're talking to it, we're communicating, and we're aggregating into a single display. The dual network interfaces allowed us to build redundancy directly into our infrastructure. We didn't have to rely on complicated switching and networking systems. We just had it right there at the source. We're able to build new software on top of Opto because of the RESTful interface, for example. Sometimes I'm able to just dig in and build something completely new off the top of my head, spend a weekend hacking, and see where that takes me. We're able to work together as a team, Opto and AFS, to produce something that's able to benefit our customers that much more. So it's really important we've found to make sure that our displays are really intuitive. We're able to put together and model the actual equipment. So when an operator stands in front of a piece of switch gear and he goes to that display, he's seeing a one-to-one -one likeness. It looks like what it looks like when you're out in the field. With Opto's modular system, what actually makes it easier for us is I can use one controller and build out whatever point infrastructure that I need. If I need this module, I get that module. If I need a different module, I get that module. And I'm able to build not just digital analog inputs, but also communication points as well. And today we're running thousands and thousands of points. From the power side of things, from a PDU, we're monitoring phase A, B, C, power, amps, uh, KVA, power factor. We're monitoring each and every one of those points times, let's say, 60 devices. People come to work and expect uh, 75 degrees, expect the lights to be on and internet to be on, and uh, they think that things happen by accident. Actually, it requires a whole team of people to support and manage and maintain the facility.